An English student at Memorial University has a busy life. Papers are due, drafts are rewritten. It's not a time for joking around. But one student has found a way to follow his studies and pursue a dream on stage. Your next comedian coming to the stage has been around for a while, has been doing yuck yucks for a while. Please give it up for Gary Lampkin! Oh God, what's up? Gary Lampkin has been a comedian for five years. Born in St. John's, Gary has had an interest in stand-up comedy since he was 16 years old. Since then, he's taken his routine from high school concerts all the way uptown to Yuck Yucks, where he hones his craft today. Well, I first became interested in stand-up when I seen Dane Cook when I was in junior high. I watched Vista Circle. He was great. Uh, he made it look fun, and I was like, wow, I think I should try this. People have told me I'm slightly humorous, and so I gave it a try, and here I am. Hi guys, who's single in here? Who's single? A lot of people, some of you, one of you got to be lonely. Who's lonely? <laughs> I write my material just based on my ideas. Things, it's a mix. It's like my ideas and stuff. Like I do a, a joke about dancing and online dating. Uh, and then it's just real life stuff, family stuff, stuff that happens to me. I was never funny when I was a kid. That's the thing you have to understand. I was never funny. I got, I got bullied. I think everyone that does comedy, Mike McDonald, Great Canadian comic, he has a great saying. He says there's only two types of comedians, the diagnosed and the undiagnosed. When you make people laugh, there's, there's nothing greater than the feeling when you make someone laugh. Like to know that you're making, taking someone out of their crappy life for 10 seconds and they're laughing, they're forgetting about it. This is a great feeling. And plus when you write it yourself and then people laugh and approve of what you wrote, it's like, this is great, I wrote this and they love it. So it's just a great, just a great feeling overall. That's my set, cousin Caroline, thanks a lot. This show, compared to the first show I've ever done, was a tremendous change. Uh, I mean, anything's better than the first time you do something. The first time I did it, I forgot my own jokes. I called someone fat. Uh, I was 16. I was, I had to, as soon as I did it, I had to get out. I was here illegally. So it was, I mean, it felt good. I, it felt good enough that I came back to do it again for five more years. So, But, uh, I mean, tonight, compared to that, was just tremendous. Girls don't fart, right? It's true. Girls don't fart. The only girl that farts is your mother. It's the only girl. <laughs> right? Well, I plan to move when I graduate, so I want to pursue it. So hopefully in five years I'll be... I'll come back and do this again, but I'll be a different... Uh, I'll be uh, famous or something. The life of a stand-up is never easy, but whether it's to a packed house or a room full of friends, Gary will make you laugh. The road is long and rocky, but Gary Lampkin will stand up to any challenge. For English 3816, I'm David Marr.